two to one. And they're off. Go back. Loney inside tries for the lead. You are KG the center track second. On the extreme outside, Sir Vance third. Power source Loney inside fourth. Mike Gold's all star fifth. Skipper's all the outside sixth. Around the turn, moving towards the back stretch. You are KG leads by length. Sir Vance now looks to drop in second. Two lengths back to go by third. Power source fourth. Skipper Zor fifth. With Michael's All Star sixth. Cousin Brucey seventh. And Deloney Bluegrass trails the field eighth. Quarter time is 27 and two. Straining out down the back stretch. You are KG leads by three lengths. Sir Vance second. Go back the outside third. Gap two lengths. Power source right with him fourth. Skipper Zor on the outside fifth. Three lengths back to Cousin Brucey on the rail sixth. Michael's All Star alongside seventh. Gap of three lengths. Deloney Bluegrass is eighth. Moving around the paddock turn, you are KG in front by two lengths. Sir Vance second, go back the outside third. That's uh, Skipper Zor has fallen and unseated the driver. Cousin Brucey has unseated the driver. Half time is 58 seconds flat. Approaching the clubhouse turn the final time. You are KG leads by length and a half. Go back the outside second. Sir Vance on the rail third. Power source up on the outside fourth. Three lengths back to Michael's All Star fifth. And Deloney Bluegrass trails the field six. Down the back stretch. You are KG in front by a length and a quarter. Go about the outside second. Surveyance third. Three quarters. One twenty-seven and two. Drivers your attention, please. Horse down in the stretch along the rail. Horse down in the stretch along the rail. Round the far turn. You are KG in front by two and a half lengths. Surveyance second. Go back the outside third. Power source fourth. The Loney Bluegrass fifth. They approach the head of the stretch. You are KG leads by two lengths. Sir Vance second. You are KG's off stride. Sir Vance now gets the lead by two lengths. Go back coming on second. Sir Vance in front by three. Go back second. Sir Vance in front. Here's the finish. Sir Vance number six, an easy winner by uh, three lengths. With number two, Go back finishing second. Looked like number one, Power Source was third. The mile in the 16th. 204 and 3. Certainly the accident had a bearing on the outcome of this race. Let's go back now to Gary and Jody. And that certainly was the case, Bob Myers. Sir Vance in victorious in a time of 204 and 3, but what a bizarre race as we had an accident coming around the turn the first time. And there you see Gary Mosier and his horse, Cousin Brucey. And we will have another look in the eventual winner, Sir Vance in taking advantage of you are Cagey and Herb Aphelion going off stride Jody as they pass that accident the second time. Yes Gary oftentimes it's so difficult to try and pick this up. We'll try and see the pile up here. There is the actually it was the seven horse skippers or that went up in the air cousin Brucey following behind him will step on both the driver Renee Poulin and also Skipper's or cousin Brucey would unsuit Gary unseat Gary Mosher and as you can see it's Skipper's or who is down on the track right now and is writhing in pain. Uh, it looks that both of the drivers are OK at this point Renee Poulin and Gary Mosher Poulin got up and grabbed his shoulder but he did get up. He looks like he's not terribly injured but the problem here is Skipper's or he is down on the track and he looks to be very injured at this point. So the accident the major story in our first race tonight on Summer Racing 90. We will take a commercial break and when we come back we will have more on the race and the accident as we continue after these commercial messages. And there you see Skipper Zor thankfully up and appears to be not as bad off as it originally had looked after that spill coming around the paddock turn the first time and here you will see it and watch the seven horse Skipper Zor take the stumble right about here. At this point Skipper Zor doesn't seem to be in trouble Gary. He just took a very bad step. His legs gave out underneath him. Cousin Brucey who was following closely behind then immediately came up behind him. But surprisingly enough after laying on the ground for upwards of five minutes Renee Poulin gave a pull to Skipper Zor reins and he got up willingly. And as you saw just there he walked off the track and seems to be OK. We'll have to get a further report on him. Of course there was trouble thereafter into the race. It looked like uh, the number three horse Michael's all star was going to be a winner but he had problems he did not see the accident in front of him and then he swerved which left it wide open for Sir Vance and the six horse to come along with Dan Daly and get the money but the story here Gary 
is the problems that they had on the track more so than the eventual winner of the race except for everybody who had a six win ticket because they're going to get 4680 on the win for